The more that we have connections within the community, the better all seniors are. And so we're able to get Senator Bradford here. He came and then we also got city councilmen from Carson that came and just to update and kind of like a town hall, casual conversation. Today's event was for the Ollie program, just to give information about the city of Carson and to get the residents in our community updated information of what's happening in their own city. I think it's critically important. Many times people make assumptions about what elected officials are doing or not doing or what is needed and not needed. And the only way that you really address a problem is by having open dialogue and having an open discussion. So this situation today affords us that opportunity. The members had asked me to see what I can do to get somebody in here to speak on issues that they bring that I can find an expert in. Cal State Dominguez Hills has been a beacon in the city of Carson. And for it to uh, provide this opportunity, it's just one feather in the cap of them making sure that they stay connected to what's happening in our resident. I think having these open uh, discussions, these casual dialogues are critically important. Just, again, having a better understanding of what's needed in the community or what's working well also, because sometimes you find out what's going good in the community as well. So uh, it's, it's a two-way street. I've put in, in a lot of work building relationships with the cities around here, the, especially the senior citizen commissions. And we have an amazing connection with the Osher Institute. They help with anything that if they have information or a way to get a hold of people, they will they'll help as much as they can too. I believe that Ollie helps create a space for them to be heard. Get the community involved, have more venues like this, more um, opportunities for the residents to come on campus. I think this is be known as a people's university and not just a higher education, it's a people's university. 